Check one, two. Do you know that song? Um, yes. Like, okay, okay. Start. One, two, one, two, hey. I know her song. Down just a little bit. On this, <laughs> it took me like two months, uh, just like to work on the schedule. U.S. Embassy was pleased to bring Piligar, an American rock band, to Azerbaijan uh, under species of U.S. State Department's Arts Envoy program. Yeah, we've we've toured around Canada a little bit, uh -huh. um, but also we did tour in the U.K. It's the farthest east we've played. Arts Anvil program is one of key culture prog programs of the U.S. State Department that is strongly committed to fostering cross-cultural understanding and collaboration as well as demonstrating shared values and aspirations through sharing the base of the American arts community uh, with the entire role. And I'm asking, you know, our like, DC of it just to send me a list uh, of different rock bands. So, and Piligar's name was at the top. Uh, before this, we had done a, an interview in Pakistan on Planet 94, Islamabad, and, uh, you know, we kind of just kept in touch with the State Department, and they phoned us. We were in Las Vegas at the time, actually, mm -hmm. and so that was kind of cool. Kind of a big, you know, big, big win in Las Vegas, you know. Yeah. The first song that I really listened to was, uh, Guilty Intentions, and I fell in love with that song. It was just like, that's my decision. It's good. It was an uh, uh, adventure. I bet. That's a lot of travel. But really, the preparation isn't too much different. We downloaded language software apps, you know. Yeah. My name is Adir Kesedar. My name is Adir Peter. The more we learned, honestly, the more we were excited to come. Now I feel like I was here for 12 days. <laughs> Excelled all my expectations. And we are going to travel to you know, Gabala, Shaki, Ganja, Minga Chavir, Sungaid. We'll see. We'll see how it goes. Now I have now I have a lot of expectations and I'm sure like we will meet those expectations. Salam, we are Filiger. Today we want to tell you more about rock history. We're going to begin with the blues. And Holland Wolf said something that captures what the blues is. He said, when you ain't got money, when you can't pay your house rent, and when you can't buy no food, then you've got blues music. The financial problem <laughs> is the biggest problem for any band, not just in Azerbaijan, in America, whether that's in our hometown, Chicago, or in Hollywood, or anywhere. We've been a band for a long time, and the first thing is you start a band, no audience is too small to play in front of. Don't feel like nothing is, it's pointless to play to four people because it's not. You never know who's in the audience. There may be somebody who's interested in financing a tour. Uh, but yeah, the no, financial but problem going. isn't a main very, problem uh, because there is uh, very few uh, people, very few uh, authority of rock music. Uh, people in Azerbaijan, they don't know what is rock. Mm -hmm. They don't know. It's uh, the same problem. But it's uh, the main problem. It's also. not easy to them either to grasp what I'm playing, what we're playing. Yeah. Okay. I was going to say that some of the most exciting music 
has come from times when no one wants to hear it. Well, then we should be making music. We're talking to you much. We're talking to you much. He's so Who has a guitar? Let's write a song right now. Yeah. The music came out of nothing. <laughs> it was fantastic to see how they created the music. Everything came out of nothing. I listen also to Osborne. <laughs> what you feel it's in music and you just feel that somebody understands this from music. When you're coming up with something it's just it's there is no language for it at, at that time. It's this kind of uh, creative impulse. And so, you know, it's cool to be able one of the things we did yesterday was um, sit around and do the, exactly that, write a song uh, from nothing. We're finishing our set. If, you, if the three members of the three bands can come up and join us. It's cool to play a kind of a hit in, in Baku. Have it, not just the people that were on stage singing, but also the people in the audience. There's no doubt that there is an audience here for rock, uh, rock music. You know, our first concert is going to be in Gabala. The landscape always changes, the venue always changes, so this is a different kind of venue. We call it Uzun Budo. Like, Uzun is long and Uzun is narrow. Tonight, it's more of a theater show. Um, I think tonight we're hoping to do a little bit more dialogue. We are so pleased to be bringing Philadelphia Rock Band to you from the United States. Thank you all so much for having us in the beautiful city. It's such a pleasure to be here. Çok geldi, çok ağla. Çok ayla. Çok. Here they come, get ready. Wow. Oh, this is out of tune. You're really out of tune. Should I continue? Do a little bit more. Okay. <laughs>
LTD EC 1000 Deluxe. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah, Orhan was cool. I really liked, uh, I mean, I like him as a person and I also really like his Very music. Very nice to meet you. Very nice to meet you. Welcome. Welcome, Welcome here. here. Checks out, checks out. <laughs> really looking forward to playing it here. This is it, the first uh, rock concert was in the powers. So long, Gianjan. But they, uh, <laughs> they uh, closed, so now they don't let us to organize rock concerts. His name is Neil Young. The song we're going to play is called Helpless. After this time, we'll say, you see, it's not satanistic. The best part about music, the best part about what we do, uh, is improvisation and collaboration. You know, like that's, that's what keeps things fresh and keeps things exciting. And for a band like us to get to come, you know, halfway across the world, and all of a sudden we're jamming on the Arts Helpless with Orhan, you know, like a, a local kid from Yandra. I mean, that's spectacular. I really like rock. Um, you know, that makes me really energy, like active, positive. That's why. <laughs> Thanks for Embassy that we organized the concert. It's a really very helpful step and for our city and of course it's very nice. They're real good and I really like their music. I just have to show it like this. Ben burada Mincesevi'de e, tekstil bir kombinat vardı. Orada beldeler vermiştim. Baktım ki orada demeli rock grupa zam yok. İnteresli bir tam. İzde arazivayca, rock arazivayca, şey arazivayca, bunun için Пойти посмотреть. Crowds here have been awesome. I mean, 
yesterday we played a show and there was a cha-cha train, which I don't care where you are in the world, but anytime a cha-cha train breaks out, that that's a good crowd. It was just a, a moment yesterday where everybody was dancing in a circle and we could have been at any show, any outdoor show. Just as you all have been students in the United States, we have been learning from many of the young Azari musicians here for the past couple of days, collaborating and engaging in a uh, shared love of music. Well, 539, uh, it means near to morning. Yeah, every, uh, everyone of ours uh, is composing the first songs. I uh, say more as El Chin. Jira El Chin. Great experience for us to work, uh, to work with a uh, foreign group band. Not only for the 5 to 9 and all of the group bands. <laughs> yeah, perfect. It just takes like one or two bands to have like a lot of success or to really put out a song that everybody really loves. They like their car and well, maybe say the like too. Like those two bands like spawn like thousands of other bands and spawn serious music scene. I think that it was a, the most unforgettable day in our like, fucking life. Till now, maybe yeah, after no, we'll be uh, the best better, yeah. Come. It's the Azarine Sakadida. We recorded the, the structure of it and then this is to build it. Okay, so can we start with recording like the Azarine together? so welcoming and we're in a different country you know we're not we're foreigners in this country and yet everyone has taken taken us uh, and shown us their homes their places and, and it's been so hospitable that 
you know, while we are in a different culture and a different place, it feels like in a way we are at, we are home. <laughs> program was successful because uh, we did actually create a established relationship between Azerbaijan musicians and American musicians. But if Philga watched this, the same uh, hello. From Azerbaijan? Yeah. And maybe we live in Chicago.